All right, so today I'm going to check out a trailer for a Netflix series called Messiah. I don't know a whole a whole lot about this beyond the name and just a vague idea of what I think it's about. Someone who says he's Jesus, like in modern times, that might be completely off base. Um, anyway, I guess I will find out a little bit more after I watch this, so I'm going to go ahead and press play now. He's come out of nowhere and we don't know who he is. What do we know about him? He's leading desperate people. So this is a cult? We don't know who he's associated with. He could be creating an army. Or he could be leading them to their death. So we're gonna walk on the water. What were you doing in Syria? Delivering a message. A message from whom? My father. And who is your father? We've lost it. What do you mean? He just disappears. No one just disappears. We all witnessed a miracle. He saved my daughter's life. You need to see this. <laughs> Bury it for as long as you can. He didn't just click his heels and end up here. He clearly had help. You get around Syria, Israel, Texas. It's the nature of my work. And what is that work? God's work. Who do you think he is? You didn't see what I saw. And if I did, would I be calling him the second coming? How far will this new movement spread? I'm going to find out everything about you. This is bigger than what you can imagine. Mm. Okay, hold on. I was I was specifically looking for oh, all right, January first. I was wondering, as the trailer was drawing to a close, when it was supposed to be coming out, and that question was answered for me. So, um, at first, when I thought about this show, I wasn't sure if I would be interested. I was a little bit iffy, kind of, sort of, because I don't generally gravitate toward, um religious themed um films and i wasn't exactly sure what this was going to be like but it looks to me like it's going to i don't know i'm getting a sense from the trailer it looks like it's going to sort of keep you guessing is he a con man is he the real thing um i'm not exactly sure obviously people in the you know, throughout the course of the trailer, they observe things that they viewed as miraculous. So it'll be interesting to see how this story ends up wrapping up. I mean, I'm already thinking about the ending. Like, what, what's the actual answer? Uh, I'm wondering if it's going to be completely revealed what he is, if he's the real thing, or if he is truly just a con man, or if he is someone else. And just there's there are other supernatural elements at play besides religious, you know, or spiritual or however you want to describe it. So I'm actually liking the look of this and I probably will check it out, but I'm feeling like this is something that like so many other things that I watch trailers for, I'm feeling like this is something that I will need to focus on. So it's probably not something that I will be playing while I am working because I want to follow the narrative of the story. I, I'm not sure how many episodes. I don't think they're going to tell me that in this information here. Oh, shoot. I thought I was at the net, the actual Netflix um, channel, but I was not very wrong about that. But um, so, yeah, I this looks pretty compelling, and I feel like the trailer did 
a, a very good job personally. It was just shy of two minutes. And it, I got the sense that the real estate of the trailer was used wisely. Like it wasn't, I didn't get a sense that it was draggy. I didn't get the sense that it was too rushed um, or that it showed too much. And I felt that the flow of the narrative in the trailer was very good. It was cohesive. You could, you could follow along and they were giving you bits and pieces that were certainly enticing you to be interested in the show, which I certainly am. I don't recognize the fellow who's playing the main, well, the girl is the main character, Michelle Monaghan. She looks to me like she's the main um, protagonist. I don't recognize the fellow who is supposed to be playing the Jesus guy, if that's, if that's really him. Um, he, he looks vaguely familiar to me. And I don't know if what's throwing me is the fact that he's got long hair in here. Or maybe he's just reminding me of somebody else. And I might have no clue at all of who this guy is. I'm going to have to look him up because I'm curious now. But um, yeah, I, I, I think this was, was really well done. And I'm certainly looking forward to it. I will be putting it on my to watch list. I honestly don't know how soon I will be able to get around to it. But let's say, okay, so it's going to come out January 1st. I might not be doing much of anything that day. I mean, it is a holiday after all, even though I work all the time. I don't really take off too much, especially for, you know, like even for holidays. So I don't know. Maybe I'll decide to sort of uh, take that day off kind of and start watching some stuff. And hopefully I'll remember that this is available now. I have a feeling I will because Netflix usually sends out um, emails to me when new series shows have come or things that they think I would be interested in based on my viewing activity. So um, I don't think I'll forget about it, but I'm not sure if I'll remember it exactly on January 1st. We'll see. And I'll come back and post a comment or make a video review if I'm super impressed or whatever. Okay, that's it for this one, you guys. Nos vemos.